It's the final week of February. We're coming down the home stretch in the winter sports season. We have another edition of Bobcat Weekly for you. I'm Russ Eisenstein. Bobcat women's basketball is eyeing a Mid-American Conference regular season title. With four games to play, the 21-4 and 12-2 and and Cats have the edge over Ball State, the West Division frontrunner. The Cardinals have three league losses, and one of those was to Ohio 60-53 in Muncie a month ago. Saturday, Ohio won 71-55 at Akron. It was the first win in the Rubber City since 2008. Kiana Black had a season-high 31. The Cats are four threes away from setting the program's single-season record. Back-to-back -back home games starts with Buffalo on Wednesday night. Bobcat men's basketball is 9-16 and 4-9 and 7-6 and 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 at home this season after Saturday's 64-51 loss to Kent State. That's the fourth loss in a row. All have been by double figures. Four games remain, and it appears likely the first round back tournament game will be on the road. The Cats did that in 2010 and won the whole thing. Tuesday night is a rematch with Bowling Green at the Convo. Bobcat baseball is 6-0 for the first time since 1965. The Cats swept Longwood with snow flying in Georgia, 6-4, 13-2, and 7-6. Cody Gartner and Manny DeJesus have a hit in each of Ohio's games. Tyler Wells did his part on sweep Sunday. He homered twice and drove in five runs. Bobcat pitchers have a two-to-one strikeout to walk ratio through the first two weekends. Connor sits his two wins. Four in Atlanta are next, three with Georgia State and one with Georgia Tech. A Bobcat team has never started the season at 7-0. Bobcat Wrestling finished up the dual portion of their season at 9-6. The 25-15 win at Cleveland State on Sunday. It was supposed to be a double duel, but Gardner-Webb couldn't make it. It started with the Cody Walters pin at 174. Ohio took the lead for good with the Taiwan Claxton pin at 149. The MAC championships are up next in Columbia, Missouri. Bobcat track and field was at the Buckeye tune-up, and three placed in the top ten in the weight throw. Denise Rose took second. Tasha Smith finished fifth in the long jump. Here's the Bobcat calendar. Basketball needs you in the stands to help secure a MAC regular season title. Three of the final four are at home. Two are this week. Wednesday night with Buffalo, and Saturday afternoon with Bowling Green. See you there. That's another edition of Bobcat Weekly. For Tanner Smith and Ryan Cochran, I'm Russ Eisenstein. This is Bobcat TV.